Hey, Harlan Sama, like I um, promised earlier, I am making a deck profile, new sleeves for the win. Look at these beauties. <laughs> They're awesome, aren't they? Oh, um, this is my exceeding the victory. I call it exceed instead of exceeds, but people do what people do, so. <laughs> so, like I've said before, I always have a level 6 deck master, so of course it's power giant for this deck. Discard a level 3 monster, this card becomes level 3, good for a level 3 Xyz. Exceeding, or whatever you want to call it. Gel and Duo, defense for when you have nothing else, of course. Um, just really powerful and DT. <laughs> it's really pretty, don't you think? The DT, how it shines. Ah, there it goes. Like kind of like a prism or something. DD Warrior Lady again for defense. When a when a monster attacks it, I got it wrong before with DD War with DD Assailant. When um. Even if it's even if only if it's only if it's destroyed by a monster, then its effect activates. But this one, when it's attacked by a monster, its effect activates. So even if it gets if it even if it stays in the field, you can remove them both from play. I have two Gaga Ga magicians because um three's too much and one's not enough. Plain and simple, as easy as that because um. Yeah. It could become any level, so. Good for rituals, good for. whatever. For special summoning. Goblinburg. Main card in this deck. Three of the six main cards of this deck. Um. Not really much more to say other than that. Um. Defense, wall of illusion, attack it, goes, monster goes back to the hand, and, or if it's an Xyz monster, or, like, Stardust, it goes back to the extra deck. That's, it's really powerful if you don't have anything else. Defender, if you want to win by deck out, keep it in defense mode, 2700 defense. Not a lot of regular monsters can beat that. I mean, Stardust can't even beat that. Utopia. Um. Yeah. Okay. The other three. Marauding Captain. I run, ran one before. And my friend Zio. Um. Zio333. Three, 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 he, um, told me that I should run three. So, I tried three. Loved it. So, I bought <laughs> three, um. Ultra, I mean Hobby League, Marauding Captain, so worked out. I took Sangan out because of its, because it, um, because of its effect, it, it doesn't work when it's attached. The new ruling. Just found that out not too long ago. So I, um, took that out and put Exploder Dragon. Again, defense. Plain and simple. It can destroy a monster when it's, de when it's destroyed. Um, yeah. Ram all. When it's attacked or is it when it's attacked when it attacked or is attacked. So long as it's face up, if you put it if you set it, its effect won't activate. Remember that. But yeah, it can return both it does no battle damage. And both monsters return to the hand, so works out great this is defense plain and simple I don't even use its effect I have just have it for a 1900 defender feedback warrior awesome card awesome card summon goblin bird summon feedback warrior using goblin bird rank 3 Xyz right there shine knight attack mode 
it's a level 3. Defense mode, it's a level 4. Good for rank 3 or rank 4. Defender, and it takes a chunk of life points from your opponent. Marshmallow. Plain and simple. And it's level 3. So, Spirit Reaper, I still don't know if it'll be destroyed or not. If targeted by rotting captain or something like that but unless I know for sure it's going to stay in so I know for sure okay that's it for monsters of course monster reborn since my deck relies on special summoning I would put pot of duality in but my deck relies on special summoning, so Pot of Duality really is not that good for this deck. Three MSTs. I like destroying shit, so that's why I put three. <laughs> Dark Hole, of course. And I got a super rare Heavy Storm now, so... Happy about that. No open man to cross out. Like I said, I like destroying shit. Reinforcements of the army. Since a lot of my cards are warriors, it just makes sense to put reinforcements of the army in. You know? Same goes for this guy. The warrior returning alive. It it's powerful for warriors, like you can add Utopia back to your extra deck, or something like that. Swords. I only run one, because I don't have another gold rare one, and I simply have no room. I could take out Warrior Return Alive for it, but I really only need this one. So I usually get my good stuff out very fast. Magic Cylinder. When my opponent... Okay, this is a funny story. Um, I had... It was right when Obelix first came out, the playable one. I sacrificed my Obelix for Great Maju Garzette to attack my opponent's life points directly with 8,000 attack. My opponent activate Magic Cylinder. Boom, I lost right then and there. It, was, it, was, it wasn't funny then. Trust me, it wasn't funny then. But it's hilarious now. Um, Dimensional Prison, of course, has to be. Because it's shiny. <laughs> um, yeah, and it just negates. So, and it removes from play. So, scrap irons. It might take up space on your field, but it's worth it to be able to keep on defending yourself. Like, keep one in your hand, just in case the first one gets destroyed. Play it. And also, I, in my, in episode one of Harlan Talk, I, um, Ask your opinion for a torrential tribute. I ended up taking out torrential tribute because I have a lot of good monsters that you know I don't want to be destroyed, you know? Because I usually get my monsters out really, really fast. So, yeah. Um,. So I took it out, so now I have two gold rare bottomless trap holes. So, and I took out Torrential Tribute, which I'm going to play in my um, rare deck. And I'm going, I have two call of the Haunted. Alright. For my extra deck, yes, I have more than 50 of these because... I bought two sets, so I have some extras. 
not a lot. Like, 46 extras? Yeah, around there. Um, so I only needed four from that pack because for some mistake, they gave me 51 in the first pack. Alright, so extra deck. Got three Utopias. Three Zen Meisters. One Roach. I should be getting another one soon if my if ZO 333 gets my um tour guide soon. He should um be sending me my Roach soon. So I hope he gets it. It has like 11 other cards too because I'm a really good trader if I want to be. So I usually give good deals and. He accepts good deals, and it's just really great. Three Granosaurus. Three Leviathan Dragon. Submersible Arrow Shark. And Levier the Sea Dragon. That's it. Um, I actually have a card being made that's been made. It's by the um, really good people in Hong Kong. Not the one, not Hector Collector Selector that I, um, dealt with before. This one actually is one card worth 60 bucks. And it has the parallel finish you see on eBay. Really good quality stuff. I should be getting it here, like, maybe tomorrow, hopefully. Because he sent it out on the 27th and it's the 14th now. So I should be getting it maybe tomorrow. I'm hoping. I want it for my birthday and when I get it I'll just show it to you guys and it's really awesome and um yeah um that's it for me have a great day on Harlan uh, Sama talk Harlan talk alright bye